हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम मैनाक फ्रॉम सिविल सेंटर एंड आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू बैक टू आवर चैनल टुडे इन दिस वीडियो विल शो यू हाउ टू रीड द स्ट्रक्चरल ड्राइंग्स ऑफ फाउंडेशन इन दिस केस वी हैव अ पाइल फाउंडेशन ड्राइंग सो एज यू कैन सी दैट दिस इज द पाइल फाउंडेशन ले आउट ऑफ वन ऑफ आर क्लाइंट्स ऑल दिस पाइल कैप्स आर थ्री पाइल्स एज यू कैन सी the center to center distance of these piles are given this point is the center of the pile as well as the column so as you can see there are two types of pile caps that is f2 and also we have f1 and for columns we have four types of columns c1 c2 c3 and c4 so there are four types of column and two types of pile caps now in this pile foundation layout we can get the center to center distances of all the pile caps as you can see the center to center distance between this pile and this pile is 3176 so all these dimensions are in millimeters because in millimeters we get higher precision than foot and inches and the distance to between this two pile is 6342 minus 3176 so like in this way we can get the distance between these two piles as well so it is best after the topographic survey that is after we get the plot dimensions accurately then we can use total station for the marking of these centers so after the marking of the centers of these footings or pile foundation after that we can go for the excavation and then reinforcement binding and then casting of the pile foundation so here was the pile foundation layout plan now let us go and have a look at the next drawing which is the pile and pile cap details so in the previous drawing we had noted the distance between all these pile caps from center to center now in this pile and pile cap details we can get the details of a pile as i had told you all the piles were three pile that is there are 1 2 and 3 three numbers of pile and the dimensions are given here 1200 and 1100 now this distance 275 is the distance between the end of the pile cap and the center of this pile so this this center of this pile to the end of the pile cap this is the distance 275 and the next distance 325 is the distance between the center of this pile to the center of this column similarly the next distance is 325 is the distance between the center of this column to the center of this pile so like this we have three pile here and the diameter of the pile used here is given here as you can see the diameter of the pile is 250 mm so the 250 mm is the diameter of the pulp we also have a bulb here you can see bulb this is this dimension is 250 there is a bulb given this is basically an end bearing pile and the depth of the pile or and the depth of the pile is also given after the analysis of the soil test report available so as you can see the reinforcement used here are six number of reinforcement of 12 mm as per is 456 the minimum amount of reinforcement to be used in circular structural members be it column be it pile it should be minimum six so one mistake most contractors do is that they provide four numbers of bars for easy casting but we should provide minimum six number of bars in this structural design they have provided six number of 12 mm bars and as you can see the ties the ties 8 mm ties are used and they are placed at center to center distance of 150 mm so you can see here the ties six numbers of 12 mm main reinforcement have been given and this dimension also have been given 150 for the bulb and this distance from the bottom of the bulb has also been given and here let us go 
first of all we need a pcc layer after the pcc layer the pile cap is casted for the pile cap we have a bottom reinforcement here the bottom reinforcement is 10 mm at the rate 125 center to center so there will be 10 mm bars like this at the rate 125 center to center and this also this along if this is x and this is along y this bar is also 10 mm at the rate 125 center to center as we can observe from here you can see both the bars along x and along y are 10 mm center to center distance of 125 mm so this is the pile cap and here also for tying we have a reinforcement of 10 mm which will tie all the three piles together so three numbers of these 10 mm bars are provided to tie all the three piles together and as you can see at the top also we have a bar here of 10 mm which will be placed at a center to center distance of 200 mm so the distance between the plinth level and the bottom of the pile cap is 1.2 meter or 1 to 0, 0 mm and the depth of the pile cap is 400 mm so this is the plinth level while the plinth beam will start this is the plinth level you can see this this is denoted by pl and this is the gl one important thing to be observed while executing this drawing on site is that the site should be properly leveled that is the the base level of all the pile cap should be the same because if the base of the pile caps is not the same it can result in eccentric loading or it can cause problems so we should properly level the ground and then while casting on the pile cap we should ensure that all the base of the pile caps are at the same level so friends that's all for today if you observe any other thing in this drawing which one you want to ask please let us know in our comment section and don't forget to subscribe our channel thanks for watching the video bye